I've been running now for 17 hours straight, just basically reenacting the Forrest Gump scene, but I don't have the same outfit. <laughs> You guys, I have seriously never seen streets that are more beautiful than this. Like, I can't even begin to tell you what Savannah means to me without it actually meaning something to me. It sounds silly. Basically, when I was a kid, I read this book over and over and over again um, about Savannah called Midnight in the Garden of Good and Evil and all I wanted to do was move to Savannah and like live my life here. All right, the Neverlanders are out and exploring. We're in Charpana, Georgia. Don't make fun of Savannah. Founded in 1733 by General James Edward Oglethorpe, a British philanthropist and member of parliament, Savannah was organized into grids and has been dubbed America's hottest darn city. Over the years, many notable residents have called Savannah home, including composer Johnny Mercer, inventor Eli Whitney, and Beelzebub. Savannah has five sister cities which were destroyed from the pure fire that comes out of the mouth of Savannah itself. Designated by the U.S. government in 1966, the city is one of the largest national historic landmark districts in the country. Forsyth Park, a large city park that occupies 30 acres in the historic district, was once scientifically proven to be only 9 degrees cooler than the planet's core with a humidity that matches that of the surface of Mars. Originally built in the late 1950s, the garden features fragrant plants and flowers surrounded by walls of fire and brimstone. Savannah is located at the mouth of the Savannah River and remained an important port city for fire retardant clothing. Parts of the 1994 movie Forrest Gump were filmed around the city including the famous bench scene where Tom Hanks' character talks about how life was like a box of melting chocolates. Overall, Savannah is a favorite place for visitors from Antarctica, the North Pole, and Santa Claus himself. Really makes me happy in this world. What? Dad's baby wearing. Dad's baby wearing? Yeah, we walk past the ground wearing a baby. Oh, like having like the, the Jordan on and yeah. okay. It makes me like oh, super excited. Yeah. Is it kind of hot that I'm pushing a stroller? Yeah. Especially a pink one. Yeah. <laughs> Said he needed a break already, so we came into the uh, hotel. We came into the Hyatt to take a quick AC break. I think everybody's okay with that. Hi. What are you doing? You want gloves? Do you like it here? Yeah. It looks like a mall. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I can. We've got um this that guy. It's very fancy. That's like a little cafe bar oh, area where breakfast and stuff is. But look at these lights, aren't they fancy? <laughs> and then those three elevators, crazy. And that's the end with some water. See, the peoples are over there. She's modeling. <laughs> What are you gonna talk about? This you beautiful zoom face. In on your face. You see that my teeth are going in. Look. I just 
because this has wheeled gaps. Oh, look. You can see it. Yeah. Hi, guys. This is a nice chair. Ian is looking for dead fish. Apparently, he has found a bunch of dead fish. I don't see any. Oh, there it goes. It's a dead fish. Hey. What are you doing? Why are you dead? Why are you dead? This is like your dream come true. I think that God should have made me southern. Yeah. Man, look at this boat. It's beautiful. That's what I mean. I don't think you could deal with the humidity. I couldn't deal with the humidity. That's why I can't live here. But if I was Southern, I'd, I'd have no choice. Yeah? And then it would all make sense. Do I look happy in Savannah? You do look happy. Have I ever told you how pretty you look in Savannah? Nope. Oh. You have not. Okay. Hey, that boat is called the Tinkerbell. Look at this thing. What? Free praline samples. There's free praline samples? Yeah. Where? Oh, you probably have to ask them. <laughs> Stick your nose over. Stick your nose over. Stick your nose over and smell it. I don't know if you can tell the size of these things, but look at this. That is a huge apple. All right, so let me teach some of you rookie parents out there how to shut your children up when you're in Savannah. Oh, look, you got a snow cone. Oh, look, you got a snow cone. Oh, look, you got a snow cone. I wish I had a snow cone. I like snow cones too, you know. Dad's gonna have snow cones. I'd shut up if I had a snow cone. This wall looks like the wall in Labyrinth. When she's walking and she sees the little worm. Huh? Anybody? I'm all by myself on this? I know what you're Okay. So I don't know if you can tell or not. From the uh, sweat glistening off of my eight head. It's not a forehead, that's an eight head. It's hot. I might not be <laughs> And it's so humid. I'm not necessarily I can't hungry. What? I'm not even necessarily hungry yet. I'm just like, it's time to eat so that we can go use somebody's air conditioning. Yeah. All right, let's go. We're gonna have to drag the kids up this, the stairs. Ooh, we're gonna go back to the burger place? Up the cobblestone. I could go do the burger place. Just... If anybody ever says anything about Savannah being hot and humid, they are totally lying. It's, uh, it's nice. There's a breeze. It's very comfortable. I can't breathe. And if you look off to your left-hand side, you'll see the Neverlanders from YouTube. Hi, everybody. Hey, hey. Uh, uh, okay. Are they talking about us yet? Are they saying anything about us? Are they are they saying the Neverlanders are over there? No. Crap. That's the best part of the tour. That was my favorite part of the tour. How are you doing? I'm pretty hot. I don't know how you guys aren't sweating as bad as I am. I meant to tell you that I read an article last night about why mosquitoes bite certain people and not other people. Uh -huh. And people who sweat a lot uh -huh. give off a, sc a scent that they like. Oh yeah. And coupled with the fact that you drink alcohol, yeah. beer in particular, yeah. there's something in that that makes your blood extra special to them. Uh. And so you're just a mess. I'm like, I'm, I'm dripping. Look at this. Hey I'm, man. You're, yeah, you're wet everywhere. You're gonna need a new shirt. I'm gonna need a, a, like a shower. This is, this is fun. 
I've been running now for 17 hours straight, just basically reenacting the Forrest Gump scene. But I don't have the same outfit. But to pay homage, I'm just kidding. I'm just walking in Savannah. I'm gonna pass out. It's so hot and humid. <laughs> so you're having fun though, right? Yeah. I mean, Besides even though it's like you're that we're melting. you're walking around in an invisible swimming pool. Are you in? Huh? Huh? What? What? There's a beer truck. Come back, beer truck. This is Tomo Chi Chi's grave. I really like his cousin Kaka Pee Pee. There's Debbie's restaurant. This is where that scene in, uh, this is where Jenny worked in, Forrest Gump. Huh. Jenny. Thank <laughs> you.